Hi Cyber Angels and new uh, viewers Welcome to Charlie's Angel Tarot and I'm Shah uh, from the channel and I do readings and this week I'm using the Transparent Tarot by Emily Carding as well the second edition and I hope you will enjoy them this week it's going to be a different spread it's going to look like um, a film and if you um, would like to have an extensive reading then you find all the information below in the description box where you can find my website or the email etc etc um, I did have a lot of re positive reactions with this uh, deck it's a beautiful deck and um, I'm going to show you a different way of reading the cards in a different kind of spread um, and I hope you will enjoy it as much as last week okay please subscribe and hit the bell on all then you'll be notified I've put a video out there um, on how to set uh, it in the settings um, because you have to not only do it on YouTube but you have to give YouTube permission um, to notify you so have a look at the video if you are not sure on what I mean um, you can do it on I've done it on the laptop and I've also done it on a mobile device okay so I hope that will help you get notified on your favorite channels all right let's get started let's go over to the reading take care and enjoy hi everybody this is your reading cancer for the 14th to the 20th of September and I'm taking doing it with the transparent cards again the transparent deck and a tarot and if you would like to see the review on this deck then you can look in the playlist under re new decks and reviews and I'm also using the time to shine deck uh, by Anne Ellis Tarot you I'll leave the link for her um, YouTube channel below, below in the description box and you can find the details for extensive readings there as well up till Sunday the 13th there is a special offer for 35 euros to for 30 minutes so please take advantage of the special offer you can buy one and give it at Christmas and so that can if so long it paid and they can make an appointment or you can make an appointment later okay cancer we open the week with the heart the heart as we all know is the lovers the lovers card and love love is here you've met your soulmate or you will meet your soulmate this week wow could be Monday I'm not doing the Monday Wednesday Friday Saturday and Sunday because I will show you where the weekend will arise so this week you might be meeting your soulmate or your lover if you are not hooked up if you are hooked up you might actually get a different perspective and find out that you've got the right person your soulmate Wow like you can see these dots here they're lying on top of each other instead of separated like last week they were lying next to each other so this week I'm connecting them literally and figuratively so you are emotionally imbalanced you might also be meeting a Gemini as um, the um, lovers represent Gemini okay then we have the knight of pentacles as you can see he's holding a pentacle this means that you will be receiving news this could be about durability and for something for long term you could also be meeting a Taurus or a Virgo or a Capricorn in the in this week you are this could be news to be careful with your money if you're spending too much money um, it means tighten up the purse strings as you can see he's got a pentacle on his chest so you might have closed off your heart or your solar plex or your mind as one is on top of your head and your whole 
chakra system as you've got two underneath the feet. The four of pentacles basically means a miser. So you might be stingy with money um, or you might be everything has got an opposite. You might be holding on to money but to me it's not only money. You might be holding on to more. I'll get back to that. The flip side to holding on to money is of course spending too much money. That's why I started off with the warning. So there might be coming, I there might be news coming in an unexpected bill that you have to pay. Also, um, holding on to something, you could be holding on to something. You might be closed off for one thing, holding on to being closed off, protecting yourself, protecting yourself. Uh, emotionally because of the solar plex and your heart but you are also stopping yourself from expanding your mind getting new ideas putting new ideas out there you might also be holding on to somebody else and that is the other side that I said I would get back to you you might be holding on to somebody really for life tightly don't do that because if you hold on to something tight, it's like holding on to a plucked flower. You see it withering away. And it's the same in a relationship. If you hold on to somebody, they might feel trapped. In this case, you might feel trapped. And you could be getting news that something new is coming along. You might be getting an invitation from an earth sign or Gemini. And you, you might have been asked before and you might have made all kinds of excuses. No, sorry, I can't. I'm too busy at work or something like that. Don't go out and enjoy. Open up. Op open up conversations. Beautiful. Now we're going on to the next level. And we're, we've got the Eight of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles. What are you holding on to? The Eight of Pentacles is opposite to holding on to. You are bored with the same routine. You want that, no, sorry, that's the Eight of Pentacles. I was talking about the Eight of Cups, so that must be significant. You are bored with something. What are you bored of? Are you bored of being hurt again? Are you scared? Bored, 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 bored. I get bored. Well, leave that aside. I'll come back to, to that. You've got the Eight of Pentacles, so you've got recognition. Be it in love or be it in work. Pentacles is also work. You might be getting a new job. Per perhaps you feel closed off at work. And that is why you're bored. See how it works? This is information not from the cards. So you might be bored and that's why you're closed off at work because you feel stuck. But look at this. You've got the Eight of Pentacles. You are getting recognized for your hard work so there will be change. Okay. Let's go on to the next level. Let's have a look. The Eight of Pentacles means you want a new beginning, you want excitement, you want adventure. But you definitely have um, a recognition. So like I said, there might be um, uh, a promotion for you there. Let's have a look. Look at this. You are out of balance. You've got temperance. So there might be a Sagi around you, a Sagittarius as you've got temperance you are trying to perhaps balance money work and the home front because this is where you are on your own this could be the home front that you're isolating yourself don't isolate yourself and this is somebody new coming in definitely news look at this fireball boom so i think there will be an uh, an extension on a contract or it could be a promotion. Look at this. 
let's have a look we've got to line them up properly this is coming right from the heart look at the bowl the cup boom shooting out this fireball now we're going on to the next card and this is your final card now this is the f fifth card and that's the fourth card so you might feel on Saturday they are the weekend the Saturday you might feel bored and you might feel that you need a change that is why you're bored you want excitement you don't want to be stuck in one place at the same time you want to move on you want excitement well look at this you've got the ten of cups coming in and look at this you have found your balance at the weekend and you've got happy families the ten of cups emotional fulfillment that is your dream uh, your wish is coming true because the nine of cups is the wish cup but so is the ten because you're ultimately happy you are with your soulmate you will meet your soulmate this week if you're not hooked up or you will find a new balance within your relationship because your cup is fiery passion something is going to happen this could be the invitation of your p partner or a prospective partner and you will join up and be a happy unit let's have a look I just want to line these up properly so you can see the film it's no good if the film is distorted there you go two people holding up the cups celebrating so there will be celebrations there will be celebrations this week because you're getting out of this stuck mode or feeling trapped somebody else might be holding on you onto you too much wow like I said everything has got a flip side now look we'll have a look all in one we've got this the heart the love we've got the heart the lovers the yin and the yang here again you've got issues with balancing you want you've got the eight of pen pentacles you want something new you want more money perhaps you don't have any money and you don't want to be beholden to anybody nor to a partner or to anybody else a Gemini Taurus Virgo Capricorn Sagittarius is in the picture could be in the picture that could be your partner or you could be meeting one of these and they will bring happiness there will be a lot of passion look at that fireball there is a message from uh, heaven or from the divine telling you don't worry everything will turn all right okay open yourself up open your heart and open your solar plex and open your mind to new beginning don't be feeling left out don't isolate look he, this is you isolating you from the groups so come together open your heart open your mind open your solar plex and you will be reunited with family and friends sometimes you know every life goes up and down we have up and down moments in relationships or at work but it always turns out to go back up again through somebody or because of somebody or because of news that you will be receiving this could be a race look at this he's holding the pe pentacle and the um, cup is going whoop and starting at his shoulder it's like be as if he has thrown the excitement towards you whoa nice one happy times are on the horizon horizon so look forward there might be also an extension in the family if that was your wish because you've met your soulmate perhaps that is what you wished for a baby or a child and you've been trying hard it's going to pay off boom extension in the family happy families 
joining forces. Great. It's like these cards melting in one. That is what your relationship will be doing so long you open your heart, your solar plex and your mind and don't isolate yourself. For your um, card we've got the purple card which is a spiritual card and the bigger karma. We've got seven so you've got a lucky number in your reading. We have wishes, dreams and wildest dreams and you're doing a balancing act and that balancing act is coming back in the temperance. Time to make a forward move or move forward. Take action with balance and discipline. If you have discipline in your life then you will be balanced. Wow! Now the answer of the angels that so look what we have. Perfect timing. So what if, if there is something that you want, now is the perfect time to go for it. Take action. You could be getting news from your GP saying you are going to be a family. Not just the two of you, a big happy family. Hope you've enjoyed this reading. Cancer, take care and be blessed and stay safe. And of course, share and like. Take care. And by the way, if you don't get any notifications, then please check out the video because I've made a video on how to check your settings in YouTube and in your mobile device or your laptop. Take care. Love you. Bye-bye.